Is I think the only way to get a prismatic big shield is by the car trader too. Like, okay. Come on. Okay. We have a two fists of a freaking chance. We have two fists of a chance to get um Yogio! What's up guys, welcome back to a new Yu-Gi-Oh! Duel Links video. Today we're going to be taking a look at Magnet Warriors in Yu-Gi-Oh! Duel Links. Since the holidays are now over and I still got the rest of my holiday break to, uh, you know, just be by myself, don't have to worry about school, just living on the coastline, I'm able to make some spicy Duel Links videos for you guys. And one of the first videos that I want to make when it comes to rank PP is trying out magnets again with Bones' new skill, Straight to the Grave. Straight to the Grave is an ability that starts to do off with Wasteland on the field and it gives rocks, dinosaurs, and uh, what else, what else, what else? Um, zombies, 200 attack and defense on the duel. So we're going to be trying out magnets. Hopefully that little bit of attack boost will help out the deck, but honestly, it probably will not. I already did a test recording on this and i just did not like how my commentary was too much on that video and i took two l's that were really freaking bad in the thing so we're going to be restarting this video and yeah hopefully this will be the final copy of the video that you guys will see right now but yeah this deck is magnets and the objective of magnets is to get the boss monster valkyrion the magnet warrior valkyrion is an eight star earth rock with the effect cannot be normal summon slash set must be first special summoned from your hand by tributing alpha the magnet warrior bay the magnet warrior and gamma the magnet warrior from your hand and or field you can tribute this card and then target an alpha uh the magnet warrior bay the magnet warrior and gamma the magnet warrior in your graveyard and special summon them Really cool card right there. It's a very strong boss monster, but the issue is in this meta, it's honestly not the best. But I just want to give the deck the shot, because magnets are just a fun deck to mess around with. Now, the way we're going to get out Mag uh, Valkyrie and the Magnet Warrior is actually playing Delta the Magnet Warrior, where if this card's normal or special summon, you can send a level 4 or lower Magnet Warrior monster from your deck to the graveyard. If this card is sent to the graveyard, you can banish 3 level 4 or lower Ma Magnet Warrior monsters from your graveyard, except Delta Magnet Warrior. It's so better summon Valkyrie on the Magnet Warrior from your hand or deck, ignoring its summoning conditions. So you only can use this effect a Mag Delta Magnet Warrior once per turn. You only can use each of the effects. So we're running three copies of this so we can just get our boy out right away. Running, uh, I was running two Valkyrions um, in this deck, but it's just, I'm not going to get two of them out in this meta. The meta is too fast, so I'm not going to be able to get it out. So we're going to be playing Mega Rock Dragon um, instead of where this cannot be normal summon or set. You must, uh, must not, cannot be special summon except by removing your play. Rock type monsters in your graveyard. All of my monsters in this deck are rocks, so we can banish some of our boys with this, which is not too bad bad original attack and defense of this card becomes uh the number of rock type monsters removed from play when you special summon by 700 very nice right here we're playing uh beta the electro a magnetic warrior this one's gonna be nice for um helping out magnets you can add a level four lower magnet warrior monster from your deck to your hand except beta the magnet warrior so when we summon this we can add one of them to our hand and during my opponent's um turn i contribute this card and special summon a level four or uh, a special summon a level four magnet warrior for my deck this is a quick effect very cool right here we're running two copies of beta the magnet gamma the magnet warrior beta the magnet warrior and alpha the magnet warrior we're running two copies of painful decision we can send one of our normal monsters to the grave to add another one of the same name and type to our hand so this is going to help us mill out our magnets so we can play the delta's ability to summon um valkyrion yeah, that's the combo right there. Or we can try to get all three of the pieces of Gamma, Beta, and Alpha just like that. Very nice right here. We're playing two copies of Anti-Magic Arrows to stop the Cancer back row in this meta. We're playing one Mirror Wall because we can give our guys a little bit of help right there. Running two Powerful Rebirths so we can uh, just special summon all of our level four lower monsters from our grave to our back to the field. It's a very nice combo. I can combo this with Delta the Magnet Warrior and basically play its effects again, which is really cool. Uh, we're running two copies of that and then one copy of Wall of Disruption. And that's going to be the deck for today's video. If you guys are excited for this video be sure to smash the like button down below i don't think i'm gonna set a like goal on this video yeah i won't but i appreciate all the likes nonetheless the support on the channel lately has been awesome and if you guys haven't already be sure to join my discord link in the description down below a lot of fun the discord it's one of the best ways to talk to me i'm really active in the discord so Let's get it going on today's Ranked PvP video. So like I said, this deck sucks. One, I'm pretty garbage at this game lately because I have not, like, the past, like, four days or so, I have not been playing any Ranked PvP. Uh, so, yeah, I'm, I'm freaking pretty rusty. And when I tried two duels um, earlier today, I just got, I just took some L's, bro. I just took some L's. Oh, man, is this a burned Yugi? Oh, man, I love Destiny Draw Burn Yugi. That's my, oh, Yugi Moto. Cool. Uh, Exodia? 
Exodia? Question mark? Uh, this is deck looking kind of thick. No, it isn't. It's just a 21 card. Did you just play and restart? No? Okay. Okay, this hand's not bad. I actually like this hand. Okay, let's see what this Yugi's playing. Uh, Tide Step Bind. It's, it's probably the skill he's using if he's playing Yugi. Okay, what is this stack? Okay. Okay, then. Um, let's just let's just get going. Let's just get going on this. Da -da 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 -da. Okay, so we're going to first summon the uh, Beta of the Electromagnetic Warrior so we can add one of our magnets to our hands. I think I'm going to add Gamma to my hand. I think that'll be the play. So I can get a beefy uh, 2,000 defense a monster. Next up, we're going to just throw down a face down. Sadly, we cannot play uh, Power Power Rebirth. We cannot play the Power Rebirth. Now, I'm going to hope that Yugi lets me kill his monster. If not, it's not the end of the world. We can just, uh, we just want, the, we want the magnets in the grave. So when we play the Delta, the Magnet Warrior uh, plays or whatever, we can do some spicy combos with that. Oh, Super Rush, okay. We're not taking any damage. That's fine. We got to get these Cancer Trap cards out of the way anyways. Also, I could play Powerful Rebirth on my turn. So I think I'm going to put my Toggle to on just so I can uh, play Powerful Rebirth. Because we need to get these magnets to our hand and to the grave. So that's fine. Uh, we're going to end turn. Turn on the toggle. So we can play a powerful rebirth when we need to. Because we can get a, we can get a one of our gammas to the field or alphas to the field if we want to. So that's a face down. Okay. We're just going to play it now. I don't really care. Just gonna play it now. And we're gonna activate his ability to add a card to our hand. Uh, due to this, due to this, we're gonna. I, I think I wanna play the painful decision if we can, so I'm just gonna add beta to our hand. Just in case of, uh, if we draw a painful decision. Tides that tilt. Okay. We should still be good, though. Uh, yeah, I'm just going to do this. Send him to the grave. And then special summon a Gamma. I just summon a Gamma. Okie dokie. Come on. This is the worst possible thing to get in this game. If you get three Deltas, that's really bad. Because one spicy plays that you can use Delta to send Delta to the graveyard. God damn it, dude. Okay, well, we're going to see if we can take out... Um, uh, is this really a floodgate? That would be dumb. That would be pretty dumb. That would be pretty freaking dumb. Anyways, let's see if this boy protects his Sergeant Electro. This is probably Horus. I'm going to assume this kid's playing Horus with Tides of the Bind. Horus Control. I hate Control decks. Oh, wow. Mirror Wall. Wow. Wow, crazy, crazy. Mirror wall, whoa. That's crazy, dude. Mirror wall. Okay, we got two magnets in the grave. Somehow takes out. God damn, why did we have, why did we have three deltas? I don't like this. I hate having all three deltas in my hand. It's either I never draw a delta or I have all three deltas in my hand. It's stupid. I mean, I'm glad you paid for that because I wasn't planning to attack next turn. So you do you, Yugi. Oh, Horus. Oh, wait, what? Okay. What is this? What? 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 Why? Why? Oh, fucking hell, dude. This, this game, this game, this game, I tell you. This game is so much fun, man. I just love this game. Ah, uh, man. I mean, I wish Magnets were better because it's just a fun deck to play, but it's just too slow. It's just too slow. Oh, we got Painful Decision. whoop de doo so we got three magnets in our grave. That's fine. We're going to play painful just to mill out because we haven't... Dude, we haven't been drawing. We only draw one trap this game, bro. It's like, why? Why? Uh, this is uh, negates. God damn it, dude. Like, fuck this game. We're just going to crash. We got to. We got, we're just going to crash. Oh, we don't need to crash. God damn it. Oh, wait, no. Mirror wall, mirror wall. We're mirror wall. Yep. Mirror wall. God, fuck this game, dude. 
Um, I think I'm going to want to power, power Rebirth beta at one point, so I'll keep beta in my grave. Uh, this game's ridiculous, though, I'll tell you that much. This game is just ridiculous. Like, we see, we got our big boy out, but we have nothing to protect ourselves. Because literally, all we've been drawing is monsters. <sighs> this is Dak, I tell you. This is Dak, I tell you. It's just, it's it's nice to get your big boy out, but, like, once you get your big boy out, you can't really do much. You can econ me. Okay, he's not going to econ me. I'm surprised. I'm actually shocked. This is actually a surprise. You want to know why? The fact that he has no back row to deal with me. Like, whoa. Come on, stop. Yu-Gi-Oh, stop. Jesus Christ, stop giving me bad hands. Kill the sergeant. Kill the stupid dog. I'm triggered. That's a man-eater bug, I bet, too. This kid's deck is all over the place. I'm guaranteeing you that's a dumbass man-eater bug. Oh, my God, Yu-Gi-Oh. Is that wall of disruption? Okay, then. Are you going to crash? You like crashing into my, to my big boys? Oh, okay. Whatever. I mean... It's fine. I, just, I don't understand at this point. I really don't. I just don't understand at this point. Okay. Ooh, that's cool. I like Mega Rock. Oh, well, let's try to go ham on this b -b 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 boy. We get it. We can get a twenty-one hundo. Boop boop boop. We're going to have to talk, attack with our strongest one just in case it's something like wall disruption. Oh, cool. It's like econ or something. It's econ or something. Could be another mirror wall. Let's see if it's another mirror wall. I didn't do quick mass either. 1800. Yeah, he has enough uh, attack if he plays mirror wall. Oh, dang. It's not mirror wall. Uh, well, okay, what the fuck? Why? Why? Dude, this is getting me Vietnam flashbacks because I lost against a Big Shield Gardener before because I was really low at life points and I was attacking with my weak guy because, like, no one plays Big Shield Gardener. This is the second time I've seen this dumb card. Why? And why do you have a Prismatic Big Shield? Is I think the only way to get a Prismatic Big Shield is by the card trader, too. Like, okay. Come on. Okay. We have a two-fifths of a freaking chance. We have two-fifths of a chance to get, um... Yu-Gi-Oh! I, I, don't, I don't understand this game, dude. I, I really don't. Bones, can you shuffle your deck better, dude? Like, please. Like, please, dude. Like, please. I wish he could shuffle his deck better. Because we have two anti-magic arrows in our deck. We had a two-fifths chance of drawing it, and nope. 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 Fuck off. End it all, please. I p Please end it all, dude. I oh my god. I want to die. This game tilts me every night. Ugh, this game. I mean, hey, go attack my gamma. That's fine. Oh, fucking hell, dude. Why? We just lost. We just lost. Why? What is with this dumb game? Why didn't we draw anti-magic arrows? I just don't understand. Maybe we should have attacked into him, but I just, I want to play it safe. Too bad, though. He has, like, I, I, I'm so fucking tilted with this dumbass game, dude. I'm never gonna hit, I'm never gonna hit King. I'm never gonna hit King games. I mean, here's the thing. I'm getting so angry for no reason, just because I'm not playing meta. But at the same time, it's so boring to play meta 24-7. It really is. It is so boring to play meta all the time, and that's why it's fun to play different decks. That's why it's awesome. Like, I wish I could hit King of Games, because most, it's like 50-50, like, there. I think it's like, people play meta decks, or they just play fun decks. It's like, it's that or something else. I don't know. Still, what is this deck? What the fuck is this? God damn it. <sighs> Oh, that's just tilt. That's just tilt right there. I'll tell you that much. It's just the tides that tilt. Tides that tilt. Well, game two of playing magnets because Bone can't shuffle his deck properly. 
Like, dude, we had monsters, like, over half the game. All of our spell and traps were at the bottom. And I bet Bones was so bad at shuffling his deck that Anti-Magic Arrows was at the bottom. Uh, tomorrow's video will hopefully go a lot better, because I'll probably be playing a deck that's ten times better than Magnets. I just don't want to just always play Meta, because that just bores me. Though. That just makes me so bored. Oh, man, this kid's playing Cyber Angels. It's 2017, isn't he? Mine's against Cyber Angels? Oh, oh, oh. Oh, man, look at that Lava Golem, man. Oh, dang. He's like, oh, man, I'm a cool kid. Wow. Oh, well, let's see some good old Cyber Angels. My fate. Oh, boy, that's mine scan. That is okay. I know that was the best thing we could have gotten. Unless he has a dumb, unless he has a dumbass Spear Ebola. Uh, he probably does. <gasps> wow, what a surprise! He has a Spear Karibo! My sanity is just going away right now. Fuck meta, dude. <laughs> dude, I started- I have not played, like, any Duel Links in, like, a couple days. And this is why. This is why right here. Just to be honest, I hope that nobody all does plays this game 24-7. Because, like, fuck, dude, that would be miserable. Like, don't get me wrong, Duel Links is, like, one of the best, like, mobile games out there. It's pretty free-to-play, fr uh, free-to-play, um, friendly. You can still get to King Games by being a free-to-play player. And it's really cool and all. But, like, goddamn, dude, I tell you, this game, <laughs> this fucking game right now, dude. <sighs> oh, okay, that makes sense. That would be the best, that would be the optimal play. That'd be the optimal play. Okay, let's see what we draw this time. Wow. Wow. Okay, so we get to add um, to our hand a beta. Let's add... Oh, we could add delta. I think adding delta would be better. I think I would rather have delta currently. Uh, we're going to put our toggle to on. Just so we can play beta with the electromagnetic warrior whenever we want to. Uh, cause it's just that, uh, just to have some guys in the defense position. <laughs> wow. Wow. Uh, honestly, yeah, we're, he's going to be able to search out for his boy. We're going to get oofed right here, boys. We're going to get oofed. We're going to take a quick L because Bones does not know how to shuffle his deck. I'll tell you that much. Bones just had no clue how to shuffle his deck properly. We haven't drawn a single wall disruption or mirror wall this whole game. Like, <laughs> why? Lakari, wow, crazy. Fuck this game. Come on, Bones. Shuffle your deck better, dude. Oh, we got three in the grave. Let's 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 try to pop. Let's just go 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 go. We gotta go fast. Oh, he has what? Of course, he has bottomless trap hole. Man, let's <laughs> let's see this. Uh, cool, sick, mean boys and girls. Let's see. Let's see, dude. Let's see. Oh my God, boys. Oh, he might not have. He's still able to play something. We can special summon Valkyrion, the Magnet Warrior. Wow. Curse of Anubis. Man, that's pretty cool, man. Man, I tell you, that's pretty cool. Man, that's, pre that's pretty cool. Man, I, that's a pretty cool meme there, bud. Man, that's a that's pretty cool. Now he's gonna attack into me with Lakari, and then he's gonna shuffle it back into his deck and bring out that blue gladiator beast, and then my Valkyrion dies. Oh man, that's pretty cool. That's pretty cool, man. That's pretty cool. Oh man, he's gonna attack. He's gonna attack into my Valkyrion. That's, pr that's pretty cool. Oh, he's not gonna attack into it. He doesn't need to. Oh boy. Oh wow, man, that blue guy, Hermelillo or whatever. Man, that's pretty that's pretty cool, dude. Oh man, I'm so happy about that. Oh man, rip my boy. Bye-bye. Fuck this game. <laughs>
<laughs> wow, this is a good card to get. You know, I could have got like Wall of Disruption or Mirror Wall, but no, I need a painful decision. This card right here is telling me that this is a painful decision that you're, pl you're playing Magnets in 2017. Like, <laughs> who plays Magnets in 2017? Oh my god, dude. I think <laughs> I'm gonna do like one more duel after this. I'm getting too tilted. This game's dumb. Man, it's a good thing he had. It's dude. It's really cool that this guy has a uh, mind scan, so he like knows what's my face down. Like right. Like well, that's pretty. That's pretty cool, dude. Oh man, I'm at 100 life points, man. Oh, that's that's pretty cool. Oh dang, and he's gonna shuffle back his gladiator beast to his guy. Whoa, that's pretty cool, dude. I hope I drop my fidget. I've been yeah. If you hear background noises, that's just me picking up stuff on my desk and just messing around with it. If one of my hands is not being used right now, it's gonna pick up just some random object and just mess around with it. Oh man, oh man, this is great. Honestly, I don't think I should title this video uh, "Playing Magnet uh, Mag Warrior Deck Showcase." I think this video should be called "Just Getting Fucking Pissed Off at This Game," because that's what this whole video is. This video is just me getting angry. Oh, man, that's pretty cool. You just throw a wasteland. Oh, dang, dog. Ah, oh, oh, man, anti-magic arrow. No way. No way. Anti-magic arrows. That's pretty cool. Man, that's pretty freaking cool. Oh, man, that's pretty cool. Waiting for a response. That's even better. Man, that's pretty cool. I love DCing because I have bad internet. I mean, what did I tell you guys? That's pretty cool. <laughs> I activated my secret trap. Ha uh, uh, the disconnect. What the fuck is this game? Yo, the only way to win with magnets, guys. The only way to win with magnets is the DC from your opponent. Oh, I feel so bad right now, dude. Oh god, this game is so stupid, I tell you. This is one of the stupidest games I've ever played, man. Oh, Oh, this deck was, like, perfection, bro. Like, this kid was, like... This is what I call anal, dude. This is what I call anal at its finest. And he just... He got, I, I, dude, I played my trap card. Heart of the Disconnect. Oh, man. This kid knew that I was losing, too. I just started throwing face downs. I was like, GG, bro. And... Oh. Oh, I'm, I'm exhausted from this commentary. One more duel and I'm done. Jeez, I, I, I'm a little rusty. Well, not really rusty at commentary, but, like, still... Still, man, I hope you enjoyed this video. It's been fun to record, but God, has it been tilty? Has it been tilty to say the least? Yeah, cute. I mean, if you watch this far in the video, you already know magnets. Magnets are garbage. They're garbage. Okay, they're garbage. Mystic Das. I have not seen a makeup player in like how long, bro? Will this actually be a fun duel? No, no, no I, 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 I don't know. Maybe, maybe. You know, I'm going to summon my boy Beta, the Magnet Warrior, and end turn. GG, bro. Easy game. Easy game. I gotta put out, yo, you know what? Better play, better play to do is to play Alpha. Alpha in defense mode. Told you. Told you. Should have played Alpha in defense mode. This is why I'm not king of games. I misplayed hard. I misplayed hard. God, this video is just a clusterfuck of just dumbass. Starboy? Yep. 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 Yeah, we need a painful decision right now. That would be the best card to draw. Wall of Disruption would work, too. We should have played defensive, though. Should have played um Alpha in defense. <sighs> that sucks. Uh, Yeah, misplays all around. Why? I'm just summoning Alpha. I mean, I'm summoning Beta again, bro. He doesn't have spell and traps to help him out. Nah, fam. I mean, even if I summon Delta, it wouldn't matter because, like, I'm only going to be able to send one monster to the grave and I have nothing to defend myself. So I'm just going to attack in the Starboy and hope for the best. Oh, wow. Super Rush Headlong. Whoa. Crazy, bro. Yeah, that's going to be it for today's uh, Yu Gi Oh! video. Um, I don't think I can trust in the heart of the disconnect two times in a row. I don't think that's going to happen in tonight's um, uh, video. 
you can't you can't rely on it twice. Uh, tomorrow I'm probably gonna do Ghost Tricks. I think Ghost Tricks will go a lot better in this uh, compared to Magnets. I feel like Ghost Tricks are much more viable than this uh, garbage deck. Like the, the, I love Magnets; they're really cool to play and they're just fun to mess around with. It's just a fun deck. It's like tier like negative, not negative. It's like tier ten. Okay, it's got it's not good. This deck is garbage. Okay, this deck is honestly garbage. But it's just a fun deck to play. It, that's all it is. It's just a garbage deck that's fun to play. Hope you guys enjoyed these. Uh, rages in this video uh yeah this will be a fun video to watch hopefully if you guys like to see me getting angry but yeah tomorrow should uh, be ghost tricks unless um some well it might not be actually I, I might not make a video on ghost tricks tomorrow just because um new events could come out tomorrow i believe so yeah there might be a hey i'm on christmas break right now so there might be a late night uh showcase on this uh new spicy events i think it's the battle city event i think it's the battle city event which if it is i'm gonna be so excited it's gonna be so much fun to go through i can't wait to live stream that and all that good stuff God, there's there's gonna be this, this christmas break is gonna be awesome guys. it's gonna be a lot of fun content coming to your way so if you haven't subscribed to the channel already be sure to subscribe for some more dual links content because i've got so many ideas for you guys another thing too is that uh yeah like the video if you haven't already and yeah, join my Discord. It'll be good to get involved with me if you guys would appreciate that. But that's going to be it for today's Yu Gi Oh! Dueling's content. I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out.